guys, so I have no makeup on right now and that's because we are doing a review of a new face mask. I don't think it's that new, but it's new to me. This is from the brand Alia Skin. It looks like this, I'm sure you've seen this all over Instagram. I have. So the brand actually reached out to me and sent this to me for free to test out. So I do have a coupon code for you guys. I'm not making any kind of money off of this. It's just so you guys can have a little bit of a discount. The coupon code will be linked right here and the description box so you can check that out. I really wanted to try this out. So when they offered it to me, I said yes, because why wouldn't I? But as you guys know, I'm always 100% honest. I wanted to share you, with you guys a little bit of background about this, kind of why I was so interested in the first place. This is called the Alia Skin Pink Perfect Mask. Australian pink clay mask. It says detoxify and brighten, which I could use some of. It's also cruelty free and vegan, which is super important to me. The little jar is super cute and just very aesthetically pleasing. Comes in a little box and this is also plastic wrapped so you know it's very secure. It's a plastic jar and it has this little thing here which is really nice so the lid doesn't get all gross and it's very very thick a consistency is like you can see that it's super super thick but it smells really nice and natural I can't really put my finger on it and I was very excited to use this because the before and afters on the website are so impressive on the website pretty much all the reviews are five star this is supposed to be good for sensitive skin which I'm sure it will be just because usually things that are cruelty free and vegan are a decent amount natural it says it also tightens pores although that is a claim I don't think that's actually possible I'm sure it can appear to tighten your pores and it can make your pores appear smaller I've had face masks do that before for. I'm sure it'll help my pores look better, but I don't think you can actually drink your pores, just saying. Also says it extracts pollutants, which is great, and it assists removal of acne. So you guys, right now my skin isn't doing too terribly. When I zoom in for my before and afters, you will see. I don't have any really active breakouts, maybe a few little tiny whiteheads, mostly blackheads, big pores in here, and some redness, some scarring. So I'm really excited to see what this does for me. My skin is combination, more on the dry side, so I hope the clay doesn't over dry me. That's something I am going to be looking out for and I'm really excited to try this out so I'll hop in and you can see my skin beforehand and we'll apply this baby leave her on for 10 minutes and then uh, we'll see what happens <laughs> used all that was on this little cap thing it's, it's so smooth feeling it already feels like it's getting a little tight which is nice feels really nice and cool somehow it feels cooling we're gonna chill i think it says 10 minutes yep sit back and relax for 10 minutes remove the clay mask with a warm wet towel and use a moisturizing cream after mask okay so it does say that so it might dry me out but uh we'll be right back <music> Okay, so I just filmed the footage of me rinsing off in the bathroom. My skin feels really, really smooth, and it doesn't really feel dry. To the touch, it doesn't feel like super moisturized and plump, but it feels just really smooth and soft, like velvety. So I liked it. When I was wiping it off afterward, my face did get really red, which you could see on my iPhone footage. It definitely got red, but it's already, the redness is already, like, receded so I feel like that was just redness from like rubbing my skin with a towel but I'm gonna zoom in so you guys can see the before and afters <music> So I actually feel like my pores look really smaller. Maybe not smaller, but less noticeable for sure. It feels really nice. I don't know how much it helped with active breakouts. I have a few little spots on my nose, but I feel like if I use this for a couple of weeks, I'll notice a bigger difference. I really liked it a lot, though. It felt so nice going on, even drying. It felt really like nice and like pampering but i'm really really impressed i didn't think i was gonna like this this much i thought maybe it would make me break out or irritate me but yeah i really like it a lot and 
my skin just I can't stop touching my face right here it's really awesome and I do feel like if you have oily skin it'll probably be even more helpful for you if you have really dry skin it might not be your best friend you might just want to keep it in certain areas so I do think next time I use this I would avoid my cheeks and kind of keep it in this t-zone area I'm really impressed I didn't think I would be this impressed I was excited to try it out but you know masks can be very like hit or miss this is a hit if you guys have any questions I didn't get to please leave them down below and I'll answer them and give this video a thumb just a thumb a thumb give this video a thumb up if you liked it subscribe to see more from me and don't forget to check out my coupon code for 15% off the alias skin pink perfect australian pink clay mess i think that's all i have to say so once again thank you for watching see you next time bye